Hi everyone, welcome back to Kanimando. Today I'm analyzing the film trailer Onward. I haven't watched it, but I have to say the animation looks really good, so let's go into it. In times of old, the world was full of wonder and magic. But times change. I'm a mighty warrior! Morning, Mom! <laughs> birthday boy by the laws of your i must dub thee a man today kneel before me that's a uh, first thing i notice is great notice how um the laws of your i look he wants to stop him of of your... so he's by the laws of your he's trying oh, then he looks at the sword and then takes it but first looks at the sword for a few frames and then takes it it's not like all sim simultaneously it the head goes first and then the body by the laws of your i must tell See? thee a man today kneel before me That's and then another thing that i liked is notice how this character here stops then turns around but notice how the animator actually animated the weight shift so he could lift this leg and turn around so we can see the anticipation to turn around even though the point of the point of attention is in this character and we don't see almost anything of his body see your i must dub the a man today kneel before me and you you have so you have the anticipation then he turns around he steps and you have the settle see how the body settles and then recalls a bit so it's it's really small but you have a credible settle a man today kneel before see this a that's okay i have a gift i have a gift this one is awesome as well i have look at the track the arc of the nose i have a gift the the shoulders go up so she goes into a squash pose he is on a relaxed pose and then goes into a squash pose making an arc on the with the tip of the nose gift and then cut back in so gift gift go before me that's okay i have a gift go before me that's okay i have a gift from your dad the gift the gift the gift. Gift. The gift. gift. Also, the timing, right? The gift. The gift. The gift. So the timing uh, changes. The okay, spacing I changes. Have a gift. Okay, I gift. Have a gift. From your dad. Okay. I have a gift. And see how they. T they t t there's an accent on. They have a gift. So the t we can feel it. From your dad. Okay. I have a gift. From your dad. Also here, brilliant. How. The pose almost doesn't change at all, but you can see how there is a small, uh, really tiny squash in the bow in the face. So the eyebrows start to come down as the body starts to come down again as slightly, and then you can, we can see how the eyes open and the eyebrows raise slightly bit. the The mouth opens a little bit. We can see the eye dot a bit, like small eye dots. And then you can see how it's, it's nothing. This shot is it's just relaxed pose. Your dad. And you it like you can see you can feel all the emotions, but the animation is really simple. It's just a change in the pose. But adding that small overlap, the anticipation with the eyebrows going down, then having the um body keep moving forward so you have a e scene so the body the pose doesn't stop the 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 lower leads look the spacing the space between the eye and the eyelid look how they drop down so making the eyes huge like what so it's just going from a relaxed to a bit of a squash and then a stretch pose he just said to give you this when you were both over 16. Also here, look at this. I really like 
uh, just a small detail. When you were both over six See how this guy is taking the this, he takes it and but then readjusts the hand again. So he's holding it here, he's holding it here, but then as he puts the other hand, holds it with the other hand, readjust this hand. So you have readjusting in the hands, so it's not like they are stuck on the one place. This guy as well, he's holding it like this and then he readjusts the hand. So it's not like the hand are glued to the object. This one as well, look how the this one uh, slides a little bit. So readjusting. So keep in mind that when you animate any shots, don't be lazy, don't have the hand just locked into the object and have it there all the time. Readjust the fingers, readjust the hand. So it feels natural because in reality when you lift something or you're moving something you're gonna readjust you're not gonna have the object just stuck to the hand and over 16 <gasps> no way it's a wizard staff that... what? <gasps> no way it's a wizard staff dad was a wizard what? your dad was an okay this one great 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 things many things here okay so first, whoa, goes up. What, look at the uh, arcs on the arc on the corners of the mouth. How the mouth opens really fluid and cleanly. The shoulders go up, and then so you can see how wow the shoulders go up, the head is going down, and then the head goes up. So it's like wow. So it almost feels like the shoulder, the torso is pushing the head up. So it's like wow. So it's that overlap, it's not moving all together, but wow, you have that overlap between the different parts of the body. What? See? What? 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 See, and then the head goes up a bit. It's a wizard staff! Dad was a wizard! What? Then this one is great for many things. Okay, so he moves back down to grab it see how fluid and then as he's grabbing it the torso the hips start to move back so he's gonna straighten up but see how the arms straighten up a bit as the torso is going down uh, is going back and then the arms come with him see how he readjusts the hand really slow and then boom first thing is the time right this when you were 16 no way it's a wizard staff so verse small movement and that's a wizard a small movement and fast movement it's a wizard staff way it's a see the arc on the nose as well track the arc on the tip of the nose see how the head dips down and goes up again so if you drag the the nose moves really fluidly that was a wizard then apart from the timing like slow that was a wizard so this contrast in the timing also look at the movement so he's staring at the thing and then he leads with the head with the eyes all uh, actually so he leads with the eyes, then the head, and you can see how when he's leading with the head, he's actually pushing the object uh, for, uh, away from him. So you have that movement in opposite, direc in opposite directions. So you, so you have that. Push away and then bring back really fast. See? So it adds constantly, it adds appeal to the animation. See, it, it's, you almost don't see it, but you definitely feel it. See? It's great. So, woo, leads with the head, then the arms come. And then the arc on the nose as well. Woo. See how the head leads again. Look at the arm, how he goes into a squash pose, and then... Wee. Great. How, look also how it reacts to the movement. It settles after the movement ends. So everything settles. It's not 
all rigid. It's all, it's not all stuck together. Look how the doors start to start to come down. Great. What? Your dad was an accountant. This spell brings him back for one whole day. Dad will be back. What? <laughs> dad will be back. Dad will be back. Dad will be back. Great. Back like back to life? That's not possible. Great. So look at the accent. Back to back to life? life? That's not possible. So you don't have to have the accent all the time on the head. Look how the accents were made here. So back. So the first accent is back. He takes the paper back. So he accents with him taking the paper back. The accent with the back taking the papers and then. Like back to life. The, back to life. Like back to life. See back the other. So the next accent is to life. To life. They don't. To li they don't accentuate really hard to life, but they accentuate it. So to life. To life. So the movement on the with the hand moving um the paper, the hand the so to life. Like back to life. Back to life. See. Like back to life. Back to life. Back to life. The accent is when moving is when moving the paper. Life. That. Life. That's not possible. Then. Life. That's not possible. And then that's that's not possible. That's not possible. He moves the paper back again. Not not possible. That's not possible. So you see how the accent weight pretty much everything, but it's not the accent weighted with big accents. You ha you can accentuate things with the small accents, like a tiny rotation on the head or a little. Flicker on the wrist. You can be original, but um, see how you can see here how many ways you have to accentuate the dialogue. Life, that's not possible. It that's not possible. This. I'm gonna meet dad. I'm gonna meet dad. Here's awesome. I'm gonna meet dad. The breaking up the movement, right? This. I'm gonna meet dad. So here's pretty much the same pose. Lip sync. I'm gonna meet. Gonna meet. So the eyebrows. The eyebrows go in two uh, movements. The eyebrows meet that, so it's like meet that. So instead of one movement, just one pose, and then to the next one, we're gonna meet that. So the eyebrows go up a little bit, and then they finish the movement. So you have a contrast, you have variation, you have a texture on the movement. It's not just one movement; it's a small movement, and then the big one. This, I'm gonna meet that. See, I'm gonna meet that. See how the uh, eyelids also go up a bit. You see, I'm gonna meet first movement. I'm gonna meet that, Dad. and see how the how when he says that and the head rotates up and the eyebrows go up, how he opens the mouth because he's saying that, and so it feels when uh, when the jaw goes up again, it feels like that when he says that that the jaw is dragging back. And then coming up again. So the same when throwing something that the wrist and the arm drags back, they the same feeling almost on the jaw. Like, but it's not like the jaw is dragging. It's actually saying that. But in the animation, it feels like almost is dragging back. So it's that, that as the head is rotating up, he's saying that. So the jaw is going down and then going up again. So it feels like it's dragging back. I'm gonna meet dad. Dad is going up again, so you have the overlap on the face. Oh, ah, he's just legs! I definitely remember dad having a top part! Oh, what did I do? Hi. We only have 24 hours to bring the rest of him back. Until then, ta-da! Oh, that's great! Then, the rest of him that's back. That's great indeed. Until then... First, look how... Okay, so he's placing the upper part of his dad on his legs, and you can see how the movement is, is like quite even, but then at the end, so it's like lifting and boom, the spacing speed up, speeds up, as he drops the upper part, so boom. It's not ex hyper exaggerated, but you can feel it, right? Boom. So it's ooh, boom. 
the uh, the body goes down. Boom. Then there's a small pause. So so you have boom, a small pause, a small moving hold as he's trying to figure out that the, it's not gonna fall, and then moves back. Then boom, so deep down and back. So boom, hold and back. Until but, then, ta-da, 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 look, the head rotation, ta-da, so ta-da, and then, so you can see how the, the move, they don't happen all at the same time, so ta-da, see his, he says, ta-da, then the head falls, then he darts at him, maintaining the same pose, like, okay, it's not falling, Completely falling, is it staying there? Great. Enough for me. <laughs> like checking, checking if the if this is gonna fall or not. Great. And you can also see it's not just the eye dart. You can see how the eye dart lead the action, but the head is also rotating. And then the head leads the action back. See? So here's the beginning of the movement. The eye, the eye dot looks at him, the head rotates as well, and then going back, the head leads the action, and he looks back again. Oh, that's great! Dad, you look just like I remember. <laughs> I just wanted to point out now. So he see how with just spacing and timing and poses, you can transmit the emotions without any facial expressions. Because he doesn't have any facials, but just by this, you can you can completely feel what they what, what they wanted to convey with this pose. So even though it's not even facial expressions, it's not even alive. This part of the body but we can feel the emotions so yeah when making the poses make sure that the pose the head rotation everything conveys the pose the conveys the emotion Out of gas. But it says we have a full tank. No, that doesn't work. <laughs> Growth spell! We grow the can and then the gas inside will grow with it. Great. Growth spell! So in so is it, this is animation, so everything is gonna be exaggerated. But look at him. Growth spell! Grow spell. So exaggeration to accentuate. Grow spell! Grow spell! The tip of the nose moving in arcs, but the accent and the accent on grow spell. So it's very cartoony, grow very spell. grow spell. Then we we grow, so we grow. The accent on grow is when he um, moves the book. We grow and opening the book, so we grow. We grow the can. We grow the can. So the can, the accent, the can is not the can. Is the can. So you can see how you can synchronize the dialogue with the actions and don't have to be on the beat every time. You figure out the way so that they are, they match, they move in synchronicity. It's like a rhythm, right? Spell. We, grow the can. we grow the can, so it feels right. We grow the can, and then the gas, ins and then the gas, and then the, ga and then the gas shows the book to the brother, and then the gas, accent on gas, and, and then the gas inside will and then the gas inside accent on inside inside, inside will grow will grow will grow the the will grow is making the circle will grow, grow. With it. Inside will grow with it and with it is taking up the finger so you see how everything is accentuated but it's not heavily accentuated it's just mm, making the animation flow with the rhythm of the words Grow with it. We'll grow with it. 
and you can also see how the book reacts so he points he pushes the book the book reacts then releases the tension the book reacts and then pushes again making the circle the book reacts to that movement and then see how everything reacts and then lifts the finger and the book reacts to him lifting the finger so everything is connected everything feels real With it. Great. Focus. So squash, pose, squash pose, focus, Le leading with the eyebrows, focus, and then the fe the, the jaw makes fe uh, ends the stretch pose. But also see how in the squash pose, how the nose, the cheeks all come up. Focus. So everything squashes. See how fo everything squashes up as and then the eyebrows lead and the stretch pose. Cause great, great. Look at this uh, silhouette on the mouth. You can we can see the teeth up and down. It's not completely symmetrical. Uh, the corners are really clean. The lines are clean and curved. It's not like wobbly or or hard angles. It's all fluid and nice and you can see how focus and as he moves the jaw up again the mouth squashes the co mouth corners move to the sides and the whole face squashes the nose moves up again so the lids come up as well as the cheeks come up the lids are affected so they move up a bit you can see how everything is connected great focus see how focus how focus look at the lower leads how everything stretches focus look at the eyebrows leading the movement again Here as well, just a small note. Notice how, so basically, here is um, making a fast movement, moving the object to the right. So the inertia now, the iner he has created quite a lot of inertia to the right, but he can't, he can't stop that movement uh, too easy. So the body is actually going to react to that. So if he throws the object to the side and he's holding it, that inertia that he created, he has to stop it. But he can stop it with the staying, staying on the same place. So he has to, the body is going to react to that movement. So it's going to move a bit to the right to settle, to hold the inertia. So move to the side and then you see how he moves a bit to the side as well, reacting. See? And takes a quite small steps to keep keeping keep himself in balance. It worked. The can is huge, <laughs> and the van is huge, and, and the van are... is huge. And the... oh. oh, great! So that's it. That was the trailer of Onward. I really like the trailer. I may be watching the film as well. Um, but anyways, I hope you liked it. I hope you learned a lot from it. And if you want any trailer to be analyzed, just leave it on the comments. So until the next animation analysis.